What's good, YouTube? Wanted to make this video real quick. Um, as a, Just to give a little context to a video that I just posted a short time ago to YouTube. So basically, it'll be the video right before this one. Um, it's a video... First of all, I'm bringing back Davy VTV Dashcam. Uh, for all those of you who are new to the channel and may not be familiar with what Davy VTV Dashcam is, it's basically exactly what it sounds like. It's um, basically a dashcam uh, mounted on my dashboard in order to uh, document not just you know, above the law, uh, law enforcement, but basically, uh, to document and record a variety of things. So be on the lookout for that. Davy VTV dash cam. I'll be uploading a lot of more, a uh, lot more content, uh, a lot of, uh, Davy VTV dash cam content. So the video basically shows a Rochester, New York cop in cruiser P-75 um, basically failing to signal a left-hand turn. Um, there will always be the cop apologists, right? There will always be those uh, folks who swear that the police can do no wrong. And there'll also be some who maybe support me and maybe agree with some of the stuff I um, I expose, right? But they may feel that maybe this is, come on, Davey, you're, you're overreaching here. You know, you're, uh, you know, that's being petty. Well, while I respect everyone's opinion, I challenge anyone who feels that way as follows how fucking lazy do you have to be okay to not be able to do this click that is what it takes to hit a turn signal on a motor vehicle we're talking about the very same people who we as a society have entrusted with the power to quote unquote enforce the law, restrict your freedom, arrest you, and in some cases execute you the way that we've seen uh, many, many countless videos of, right? These are the same individuals who have a power like no other profession in the world. And when we see a police officer abusing that power, whether it's something as petty, right? To use the word that some people will call me for posting that video, as not using a turn signal or whether we see cops, which we all have seen cops parked in handicapped spots, right? The misconduct and the corruption and the above the law mentality of law enforcement officers often starts small, often starts with that above the law, fuck it. I don't have to turn. I don't have to use my turn signal. I can talk on the cell phone, right? I can park in a handicapped spot because it's that badge and that uniform that makes them feel entitled. And then... Like I've told many police officers, most recently, Officer Jeff Mitchell of the Rochester, New York Police Department's uh, Traffic Enforcement Unit, right? A lot of you saw that video. 
If, if you haven't, check it out. There's five parts to it. Very, very professional, very nice, very courteous officer. But it is exactly those officers who get a bad rap, right? Because of officers like the one that you saw in that video acting in that above the law fashion, that entitled above the law mentality where they feel that they do not need to follow the same rules, laws, regulations, policy, whatever you call it, that they will stop you or me for and issue us a ticket. Think about that. So before you're quick to give them that pass, right? Before you're quick to, you know, say, come on, baby, that's, that's a little petty. Come on. Think about it. Is it really? Is it petty that the very same individuals who would not hesitate to stop me or you for doing the very same thing that they themselves feel entitled to do. Is that petty? Think about that. Like always, thank you for watching. Peace.